What's up, y'all? So today, I want to talk about NoFab channels. Now, if you're new to NoFab, you don't know what NoFab is. It's pretty much where you don't beat your meat and you don't watch uh, adult videos. The hub. They don't. YouTube doesn't like you saying the sworn word, the one that starts with a P. So I'm gonna just call it the hub from here on out. You know what I'm talking about. But um, yeah, that's pretty much what it is. No fat. Why I think this is BS. Like a lot of these channels, these dudes, you know, they be on online talking about. Man, I watched this one dude. I tried it before, you know. I did a video on this. Uh, I did it for 30 days. It got a lot of views. Everybody was like, yeah, it, it, it's it's BS, you know, because. Okay, here's my thing with the hub, you know, watching the hub, adult videos online. That can be de very detrimental to your to your mental health if you're steady watching, like, you know, video after video, um, hours turn into a whole day of you watching, sitting there watching that stuff. Or if you're sitting there just, you know, watching it every single day. Yeah, that can be bad. Um, me, personally, I did it because I just wanted to, I watched, you know, I got into like a little binge of watching like these no fat videos for a little bit. I'd be on YouTube sometimes I'd just be Damn my beard's tripping. Like look at this nappy shit man. Gotta do something with it. But uh bear with me y'all. Yeah sometimes I get into a YouTube binge and I was looking at these no fat videos and this dude, this YouTuber I follow named Andrew Hales, I don't know if you watch him. He started off doing pranks and stuff and he did like chatting with different type of people. And he was chatting with a 500 day plus no fapper. Like dog he didn't get, he didn't beat his meat at all for 500 days. It's like, bro, like, what are you, what are you doing? Like, that's crazy. Your, your shit's literally about to fall off if you don't do that. You know, you got to do something to release that. After those 30 days, you know, and it, the dude asked him, like, did you get any, like, did you hook up with anybody? And he was like, no. 500 days. Whoa, you're tripping. Um, even 30 days. I did 30 days of that stuff and... Honestly, my my thinking was clear because it wasn't like a mental fog from watching the hub and stuff. I don't watch the hub like I would watch it like once a week, you know, and watch a couple videos a week. And I'm sure everybody's done that. But I think like living in a fancy fantasy is is bad. Like you're watching other people do stuff on screen. You're not actually doing it. And I know with the, the pandy going on right now, it's hard for people to, you know, they're, they're scared to interact with each other. So that just increased people watching time. I feel like it does mess with a lot of your mental health. And I'm kind of going all over the place. But going for like 500 days, even with me, for 30 days, I did a 30 day video update. Dog, my, uh, my aggression and my um, thirstiness was off the chain. Like a woman would look I see a woman, I I mean, I'm a little thirsty now, you know. I see a cute girl, I'm going to look. But I was like snapping my neck to look, you know. 30 days of not doing nothing, you know. That was crazy. I had to release that somehow. And it was hard for me to even get stuff done because I was just holding all of that in, you know. And these NoFab channels, like I see like, I seen a couple of the channels, like I watched some of their videos. They're like, yeah, I... Oh, I got superpowers. Girls are magically attracted to me. Look, I beat off a couple days ago, and girls are, uh, I'm gonna keep it real. <laughs> girls look at me, you know, because I work on myself, you know. I think the main thing you should do instead of trying to go for a certain amount of days to refrain from that, yes, cut out the, the hub and all those adult videos, but focus on yourself and not just posting videos of, oh, yeah, day 800. My, my my thing fell off yesterday. <laughs> I mean, because that's how I think you would feel. Because when I did that 30 days, my aggression, like I said, was like crazy. You know, I had like so much aggression and so much like built up, you know, energy in me that I couldn't focus on other things because I was too focused on trying to get laid, you know. So I think it's good to do it like maybe like once a week, you know, but without the adult videos, I think it's good to cut that those addictions out because a lot of people saying like adult videos aren't uh, addictive, but they can get addictive, you know, like if you're watching, like I said, if you're watching it from day, days to, to night to every single day, you know, and you're beating it and dust comes out. Yeah, you got a problem. I watched a, a Mike Tyson interview and he said he used to watch, he used to beat off so much that his, 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 
his shit started bleeding, you know? <laughs> like, like that's crazy, you know? And um, I think we as men gotta like, this is just, you know, I don't know how women do with this type of situation. Gotta just, you know, focus on ourselves and control our urges more. Why I say these nofap channels are cringe because like a lot of these dudes don't look like they're actually trying to like self-improve. Like you look at them, they they they're not in the gym. They're they they're just posting videos about nofap, talking about nofap, 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 nofap. It's like what are you doing with your life besides that? You know? Are you actually like trying to accomplish things? And I didn't watch every single video on it because there's thousands of channels on this. But um, the ones I did watch is like, it looks like you're not even, like they're sitting in their car talking about thousand days of not touching myself. I feel amazing. Like, nah, bro. Like, like, come on. Stay away from the adult videos or at least cut it down. But not taking action in your life and doing something with it and just posting online about how many days you didn't beat your meat, you know? And they're talking about like they got superpowers and stuff. Honestly, I, I legitly think it's all in your head. You know, there's no type of superpowers that come with it. Yes, I think you get mental clarity from staying away from the videos, but yeah. That's just my two cents on these cringy, no fat videos. Um, now you know if you didn't know about these videos. Uh, I Like I said, I've watched a few, you know? Um, appreciate you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Comment down below what you thought of this video. Peace.